and Hello everybody, welcome to CCL Season 49, Round of 32 match between Kill Bill Waltz and his humans and Gadenik and his vampires. In the booth with me is Dimmy G and Squirrel Dude. Hello. Hello. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah, so we have Kill Bill, Kill Bill with humans, he is down a bunch of TV, he's got a wizard, he's got a bribe, um, and he is up against a really, really, really good vampire team. We've seen a rubbish vampire team with Elliot, and now we've got an amazing vampire team with Gadenik. Like, just unbelievable, isn't it? Look at these loads of really good vampires. Incredible. And the human team is very, very normal. It's a very normal human team. Well, there's 11 of them and there's 9 of... Oh no, there's 10 and a, got a couple stunt guy. Well, I guess, yeah. yeah, he's got a strength 4 pommer, that's really nice. Strength 4 tackle yeah. pommer, especially against Vams, right? Having strength 4 tackle knight is, is incredible. And then pom, pom him if you can. So... There is a DP right there though. Doesn't care. Yeah, I'm, I would, I'm not sure I'd have piled on him, but I would have piled on the vampires occasionally. And, uh, yeah, like, it's, it's alright, isn't it? Yeah, a couple of strength ups. And obviously Griff. Yeah, not only has he got a wizard and a, and a bit, Bribe, he's also got Griff all board, so... He was down oh, that's quite nice. Up. That's quite nice. Base is the DP. Yeah. With the side stepper. Does get his catcher hit with tackle, surely. You would or think sure. The arm probably wait, so giving up, you know, one hit isn't over. Wait, it stops his pommer getting fouled is the main bit. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Unless he runs around and chains out the pommer, I guess. That was an option, right? He could have he could have come Ooh. around here and blitzed him and chained him in. That's pretty exciting, Jim. But he's just gone straight for the ball here, isn't he? He's gone straight for the ball sack, is Gadenik. He does, he does know he's not going to. He's going for ball pressure, not a ball sack. Catch got slapped. Yep. But Palmer just did something. It doesn't so. go with him, but he's, got, he's oh, yeah. got some penetration from these these three vampires. I think that Palmer is going to blitz a vampire. <laughs> the IG5 yeah. one. The move one? Stand firm one. There, there's a lot of choices. He has quite a few choices of who he wants to go after. <laughs> I think the move one because or, or the edge one. Mm. I like the edge one, but he's the setting up. One. I think he's setting up for the one. No, yeah, the move one around the back. Yeah, yeah I thought they were more dangerous. Armor bottom seven as well, of course. Of course. <laughs> also, by going there, you're away from the dirty player, aren't you? Which is nice. <laughs> so you can pile on. Pallon! Armor value 7 mattered. Yep, everyone who thinks that uh, having a strength 4 standing player standing matters is obviously wrong, just pile on every time because, you know, having this guy off the pitch is better, isn't it? <laughs> yep. Oh, full pal. Yeah. Really nice turn. Mm -hmm. Kill Bill. And strip ball based as well. Already low on thralls, really, for how many vampires are going to have to be using now. Yeah. Oh, pro fails. Good old pro. Gears works. So here we go. 2D on Griff with tackle. Oh, does cast his own player. Yeah, like Elliot just didn't hurt his own players with the, uh, mm -hmm. with the Bloodless, although he failed loads of them. Nick has far more spares than Elia did, though, so yeah. as well, it's not so bad for him. All power on Griff. Wow. Mm. Oh, this is the other thing about Nick's vamps, isn't it? They've got like two AV7 vamps. Yeah, yeah, that is a, that is a bit of a weakness, to be fair. And bit, one's, yeah. one's already gone because he because he got pommed out because the other side and the other one is about to get pommed out. No, I guess it's hard for him to pom him now. Yeah. We need uh we need Hellboy to do like the pom song. You know like the Fong song? <laughs> yes, that'd 
that'd be really good. <laughs> oh, that's really good, actually. Holy shit. But He's just going for the dodge to hit this. Reroll it. Yeah. Instant reroll. Oh, he is going for the. the big boy. Yeah. Uh, armor 7, isn't he? He is, Jim. And he rolled a 6. And then he rolled. And he's gone. Oh, wow. And it was the AV7. The AV. Oh, my God. Both, I... both of them. Both of them. It was the Armor 7 that got them removed. <laughs> and niggled. And niggled. Because that was. Yeah. And he's alright. He's got banged on super hard, hasn't he? Yeah, a little bit, yeah. Two cards, three kills. And three turns, that's pretty bad, yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's D2D mean? Dog to the dog. Oh. Who is Kill Bill Watts? Bloodlust again. Nick's suddenly out of tackle, isn't he? Mm. Oh, he is now, yeah. <laughs> Bento! <laughs> oh, I've got another Kaz. Uh, the only way to beat these vamps is to get lucky in Bangalore. I mean, pretty much for this, for this team, yeah. That's... That's all they've got, right? El elves could out, out elf them. Um, but yeah, certainly dicing them is, is your main route to victory. <laughs> I mean, I mean, Nick has got a track record of losing in far superior matchups, right? <laughs> yeah, he does actually. Yeah. Um, Necronome is potentially one of the biggest. Gets the surf and gets the pump. That's pretty glorious from Kill Bill. Yeah. Could have been really different though, couldn't it? Because he did get sacked and uh, there were yes. some opportunities. Yes, yeah, splits the tackle there so that he uh, even reroll it. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't hate greeting that. Right, just pomming. Pomming vamps is just too good, isn't it? Yeah. Basically. Especially now that Nick's already used his Apo. Region means they still are in for the next half. You have a wizard. You have the ball on Griff. It's pretty safe. It's literally five, five vamp players left. <laughs> yeah. And it's turn four. Nick's turn four, he's lost six players. Yeah, that's pretty brutal. That's how vampires go sometimes. Sometimes. Only sometimes. Yeah. You, you haven't seen my stream, mate. <laughs> this is every no. game. Every no. game! Every fucking time! So, again, he'd be going for the tackle, won't he? Oh, he already blitzed, so. Instant. Because even though he's, like, worse than the Edge 5, he's he's one of the ways you can get Griff down, isn't he? Griff, yeah. Mm -hmm. And there you go, he's Oh, gone. man. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, we've got, a, we've got a Luminous Soul kind of match going on here. <laughs> man. Every time he's hit a vampire, he's removed it, hasn't he, apart from once. So pretty good. It's actually over half the players as well. Like, it's, <laughs> it's horrendous. Yeah. Like, you don't need diced or not to, <laughs> <laughs> to know that you've been completely shafted. Yeah. I think Armus would actually be right for once about this. Yeah. But you see, Dog to the Dog did the right thing of piling on with his strength forward. Mm -hmm. No, he was playing the right strategy, which is my team is worse, so I'm going to play for a higher variance. I'm going to do things that are a bit risky for the chance to just win the game. But I'm not even sure it is more risky, like, it's just, like, piling on is that powerful. Like, that's the thing, I think, people love yeah. to think that, and it's the same with maxing blocks, you know, people, there's there's some people that love to, uh, ooh, well, he did get the uphill strip, but with three players he has managed to get a hit on the ball. And gets the ball as well. <laughs> but, uh, 
there are a bunch of people that like to, you know, disparage certain coaches and stuff and call them greedy bangers and stuff. But at the end of the day, that's, oh, what? What? that's most of the uh, that's most of what blood ball is. At the end of the day, isn't it? I mean, that was pretty Bloody horrible. That one gaze for a for a uphill yeah. muscle strip. It was pretty. Bloody 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 Bloody. I mean, like, I don't even think he picks it up on Griff now because he can score on whoever he likes. As he's only got three turns, probably has to pick it up on Griff still. Yeah, I'd pick it up on the catcher. No, I want the catcher further upfield, so if things go badly, it's easier to get it in scoring range. There's two vamps! Uh... <laughs> There's two vamps! Yeah, yeah. I, I'd definitely go with Griff. It's a two plus. Yeah. Yeah, I want the catcher more easily into scoring range. More quickly. So like the catcher gets knocked down here or something, it's still not too hard to get it in range in time. This feels not quite safe enough. It's just a it's a minus two D. Oh, okay, now it's what is it to Yeah, he's got so many players that he can make. Yeah. Like, there's two six. vampires. There's two vampires. You've really got to struggle to make it not safe. <laughs> it's a challenge to make it unsafe at this point. <laughs> this is this is the most ridiculous game of Blood Bowl ever. This is ridiculous. Right? It's pretty ridiculous. It's less ridiculous than than some games though, just because you know yeah. they can go like this because they eat their own players, don't they? And then uh, mm -hmm. you know you're pumming them as well. But yeah, it's still pretty yeah, That is kind of what's happened. Nick has kind of eaten his own players and he has gotten pumped. It is kind of in the realm of the worst possible ways vampire games can go. Yeah. And he still has a ton of players for the next half, and he should get a couple vampires back with two KO recoveries. So he's really possibly just going to be down one vampire anyway. Yeah. But vamps obviously don't want to go to OT. Typically, I don't think. No. So maybe but, yeah, I don't think they want to go to so 16 at this point. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they don't even want the second half. Just make it end. Yeah. I don't know why Griff, Griff could have been here, couldn't he? That's much better. But, uh, yeah, just a little bit closer. He's not going to build it. He's not going to build a screen in front of you, is he? <laughs> <laughs> not really. Not with two players, no. He's going to struggle the screen. He's going to struggle the screen you off. Yeah. Oh, he just bloodlusts instantly. <laughs> We're gonna have a first half pitch clear, probably. And 3D him. Well, this is safe. Yep, I wouldn't have even proed it. I wouldn't have even proed it. Well, oh if you pro a D60, he can run away, and then the other one has a chance to bloodlust and be safe, right? Yeah. You can run them far enough away that they can't get 3D'd. I guess it's the advantage. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, first half pitch clear. This is this is pretty uh, pretty special. I bet this is not exactly what Kill Bill was thinking when <laughs> he got into this game. No. No, he's got to be pretty happy about this. Yep, there we go. First half pitch clear. Pile on? No, no, because you, you can't risk the pitch clear. It's too much fun, isn't it? The fact that they four plus regen anyway. Yeah. Well, what? It's, it's a four plus regen versus seventy five percent KO. Yeah. Effectively. Yeah. First, yeah. Versus yeah. nothing, so it's. Versus nothing. It's basically a one. Half time is nothing. One six times, no, a little bit more than one. One three times, you get a twenty five percent increase. Hmm. Probably not worth it. I think it's about. Turn seven. Just don't think yeah. Is. Uh. Good day, cocky. Oof. Nice start for Nick. Mm. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Great. It's not a good day for Nick, no, it isn't. Is it? Still got nine though, and that's even with failing four out of five, so he should have eleven for the second half. Pretty funny to get pitch cleared in the first half and then have a full eleven for the second half. Yeah, it is, to be fair. <laughs> He had a bench of five, didn't he? <laughs> yeah, but a lot of those were like mangled thralls. Yeah. 
yeah yeah a lot of these a lot of these are mangled yeah that's a good point uh he's got an edge two one he's got a move five edge two one <laughs> he's got an av six one <laughs> so yeah he's got he's got three mangled thralls yeah <laughs> there is that a blitz just to, just to make sure the dicing continues even though it doesn't matter you know or well, touch back you know could have done things with it yeah yeah sure could have done these joueurs sont tout proche le combat paraît inévitable he was just saying up for the right, wasn't he? Nick. That's why the two thumbs were over there. And he was back rather than just like hitting the LOS. I reckon he was listening to Hello Darkness, my old friend. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he probably was. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid children's game, don't want to play. <laughs> this would have really tested Nick's unfuffability, wouldn't it? Well, I'm glad he chose not to be flapped by this. You know? yeah, probably, he probably did choose to be unflapped, honestly. He doesn't really get the hab to end, just snake eyes on a meaningless result. Yep. How oh, these KOs though? Oh god! You got two yeah. out of nine. That's fucking terrible. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't have eleven men. He's got ten for the second half. Oh god. Down a vampire. Cool. Down two vampires. Yeah. Has no tackle again. Mm. Yep. Tackler cast. Tackler killed. This is uh, this is bad times. Ooh, his Russell strip was gone too, so he doesn't have any really way to get the ball back reliably if he loses it. <laughs> Which, since he's facing a wizard, is probably a consideration he should have. Yep. But he's just going to try and bang it in anyway, right? Because Vamps yeah. can't really stall for eight turns anyway. That's the problem, biting their own thralls. Just makes it almost inevitable that they can't solve it. The kind of, but uh, I see that Kadenik is a Jimmy viewer with the starting block dice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The old Jim pals. Don't say it's not over. over. It's not over. Oh, there's a one. Yep. Yeah, this is this is full on. This is oh, and a one on the bloodlust. Oh. God. <laughs> Pro, he's gonna remove his own throw, isn't he? <laughs> After that LOS, he's gonna remove his own player. Yeah. Nick's really paid a lot of attention to how Elliot was playing and how Jim plays with these blood losses and block dice. <laughs> and if anyone before this game thought vampires was a good idea, <laughs> here's why they're not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, getting dice does make, make a lot of teams look pretty bad, doesn't it? Yeah, but I mean, it's 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 pretty likely Bams do. That's the thing, isn't it? The fact that you're rolling to eat your own players, it's so much easier. It's so much easier for Bams to get dice than it is for anyone else. I they think. dice themselves, don't they? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's like... yeah, a two plus two removal player is a every single turn is is pretty bad. Let yeah. alone rolling multiple of them. Yeah. It's not over. Don't say it's over. That's good, isn't it? Edging with the uh, strength four here. <laughs> so Nebch, but, you know, what's the majority for that? Glorious. But, you know, no, I won't get. give in. Until I'm victorious, it's, and I will defend. It's defend. all over but the I tears. I will defend. <laughs> it's all over but the tears. <laughs> Thank you very much, Moradan, for staying fantastic for 62 glorious months. And a tier 2, unbelievable. Thank you so much. And I missed Jay Bazza. Sorry, Jay Bazza. Uh, 25 minutes ago, I totally missed Jay Bazza. But thank you very much, Jay Bazza, staying fantastic for 8 glorious months. Oh, yeah.
Sorry about that. Didn't remove his own player with the blood loss. Right. I feel like things are really turning around for him. <laughs> oh. It's because he can't roll over a two. <laughs> <laughs> yep, 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 there you go. A whole turn of nothing but ones and twos. <laughs> it's pretty shit, isn't it? Here come the sixes. No. No? Dice Lord. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, no. Oh, there's a three. Wow. <laughs> it is possible. Dreams do come true. <laughs> like Gabrielle, right? Mmm. Great job. <laughs> God, I can't get knocked down. Hey, he's a pro. Yeah, it was a good tune, wasn't it? A few years ago now, mind. Oh. I wonder if he should have gone for the 4 2 to get that through just to have two scoring through. Well, he's doing a good job holding up three players, I guess. Yeah, he is. That's probably why he didn't do it. But, I wonder if he should have done it. I'm not sure I like Kilgore's idea of block with the lineman, follow up, and then put another lineman right in at the same place so you can <laughs> take the block anyway. <laughs> not sure that was the one. Iced. Comedy Mega, isn't it? Didn't even knock that. It didn't even knock down that vampire. Look at just the grouping around him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It's pretty funny. It's it's funny like that looks secure if you are new to Blood Bowl, you're like, yeah, but that's just still just a three plus. It's a, yeah. It's still just a three to get out. Yeah. So how the weirdness of dodge rules, but eight players around is like, alright, it's, it's a three. But things changed. Yeah, he needed He needed an X cage, didn't he? Mm-hmm. It's a fireball. Uh Griff was closer to the vampire, maybe. Yeah, that's the uh, thing Griff's a long way away. Maybe it's the lightning bolt. Do you, you need to use a wizard? Like, I think it's a nothing. Yeah. Hey, hey look at. Pro not work, not but he still failed. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't go for a wizard. Should consider fouling that vampire up top, I think. Yeah, could do. He hasn't got anyone to deal with, though, has he? Uh, Lyman can do it. Geophys, maybe? I'm not sure, I can't quite count the square. One Geophy or is it two Geophys? See that Lyman, that dirty player back. That just seems. It's impossible now. Yeah, it seems not a good idea to do when you can punch somebody. Yeah. Punchy, punchy. I'm pom the edge, isn't he? No, he's not pomming. Wow. Uh, He's going okay. with Griff. That's nice music. Well, yeah, now Griff is actually close enough to the ball that now a wizard is like really threatening, I guess. Yeah, yeah, it gets Griff in the mixer, yeah. Yeah. Ta ah, okay. He's fine with a catcher. Oh. I can't give a shit. Yeah, because he's got a bribe, hasn't he? So, yeah, the catcher. Yeah. Catch foul seems really nice. He can't can to try and score next turn, I think. I think he wants to strike the as fast as possible. Yeah. Well, he's, he's only just in range. Yeah, I think he probably should have moved up closer. More, maybe, yeah. Yeah, I think he had to get closer. Yeah, I thought it was weird not moving the guard dodger after. After doing the foul, there was no need to keep him there, was there? I guess you stole the foul here. And then. <laughs> Make the touch. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Oh, here we go. The ball is in. Griff ready just... to react. <laughs> KO. Yep. <laughs> Where's the ball go? Out for Griff, perfect. <laughs> oh god. Comedy Mega is pretty much complete at this point. Oh, 
big of the with Griff that can just now, I guess not. There isn't an instant start, score back to end the game, but there is a get the ball and Griff to end the game, which is pretty, pretty close to as good. Yep. Griff gonna Griff. This is definitely probably one of the better matchups for Griff, though. Griff can be very hit or miss. In a game like this where the other team doesn't have like a mighty blue tackle, they can deal with him. He's so powerful. Yeah. I mean, he had two tacklers, but they were expertly targeted and rolled, weren't they, by, uh, yeah. by Kilgrim? Yeah. On another day, he could have had... He could have had... Uh, I can't remember who had the... Who played Luminous in the last round? No. Well, it was Luminous' armor, wasn't it? Yeah, Chirgan. Yeah, he could have he could have rolled like Chirgan and not hurt them at all. But instead, he yeah. rolled like Luminous and slaughtered them. <laughs> Chirgan. As uh, Demi would say, Surgeon. <laughs> <laughs> Surgeon. <laughs> Surgeon. Oh, another double oh one. Oh my god. <laughs> Fantastic. Wow, well, probably should just move Griff first. Instantly. Yeah. Don't see why not. Yeah. Mighty blows are pretty fun, I guess. But yeah. He's just taking the piss now, isn't he? <laughs> <laughs> he did try moving a ta into two into a tackle zone, but he still double won it, right? He still it was a three plus, but he still did double won it. <laughs> but yeah, he didn't well, have to double won it that time. Because Artemis, you would look at the armor and say he rolled three ones, so it wouldn't even matter no matter what he did. Something yeah. Like that. <laughs> but yeah, I guess he rolled. But yeah, it was just a one in nine. Technically. Instant, instant bloodlust, and... Alright, minus two with, uh... No block, no wrestle, no tackle, no strip ball. Play. Let's go for a 1 in 36, no problem. It no. has happened to me. Yeah, it's happened to me. Yeah. I had a bludge ghoul, bludge strength four ghoul, it just got... Oh no, it wasn't even strength four, it was just a bludge ghoul that got uphill by a goblin. <laughs> actually, I actually do think the correct player was to go for the minus 2D. I, I don't think there's a hope something happens, I don't think just standing back here does anything. No, I, th I agree, I think he should have gone for the uphill, he's just not going to get better than that. Yeah. <coughs> I mean, with all the snake eyes you'd see Nick roll this game, you'd think he'd see that at 1 and 36 is a pretty reasonable outcome. Yeah. Yeah. Has he blitzed More anybody? On it. Did he just not blitz that turn? No, he didn't. No, I don't think so. So uh -huh. oh, Griff now uses sure feet and walks the ball into the end zone. Yeah, maybe do a blitz. That's a 1D? No, it's, uh, it's a strength. He's a strength 4. I thought he was a strength 3 blitz over again, but that doesn't look at gaze, but no, it's fine. And he's strength four uh, pommer, and that's what I'm saying. Like you know, some people would have you yeah. believe that if you've got a strength four pommer, we'd only use it because he's strength four. And it's good having a strength four around, but it's also really fucking good to pom people. <laughs> it's almost like <laughs> horns on beastmen is why they're so good at killing stuff because they can blitz anything they want all the time. Mm. So he's strength four is pretty good for uh, getting removals. Yep. Also, it's not like he has guards. So standing up isn't even like that important for him. He has to actually be around outside of tackle zones writing assists, and he's going to be in tackle zones all the time. He's just going to be on his ass all the time, isn't he? Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm a bit surprised we aren't just going for the score, but I guess if you don't have to roll dice, you don't know. Ah, uh, he probably wants to scone somebody else, right? Mm. That's fair. Maybe this, maybe this blitzer. Oh yeah, he wants more on that guy who's one SCP away after this. That guy can chase a Kaz or something. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah that guy can chase a Kaz on a yeah. Thoral and get to um, tackle or something. Tackle or same firm. Or oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> yep, that was a double one. Oh, I don't like this. I do not like this from Kill Bill. 
I, I definitely blitz with this mighty blow guy to try and get in the 2SPP and then hand off to him so you level him. Yeah, yeah, I think that was a misplay there. I know, like, I know this is technically better for winning the game, but I think, I think you definitely go for the blitz on him and then hand off to level him. Yeah. Because, like, what the fuck can Nick do? Like, his vamps are out of range. But you know, probably just buzzing to death after dicing fuck out of Nick and winning easily. <laughs> no <Yeah>. damage. <laughs> yeah, at this point you might just be thinking, I'll just take the win. It's it's a win against him. You're better. You thought it was like way better than yours, and it was. And you're just like, I'll just take the win. I don't care. Or just get me out of this round. Get me to the next round. Yeah. Healthy and not to deal with anything. So just no chances. It's reasonable. Woohoo! That's like, pretty good. Isn't it's it being Nick? Even even if you're dicing, it's pretty good being Nick. If this was a ladder game, I think he absolutely thinks to go for the touch, the score on that guy and the blitz and all that. But I think if it's a uh, you just get to the next round and figure it out there. Oh, yeah. didn't make it. Yeah, now this turn he's trying to roll a six for a chance at the uphill, like mm -hmm. double power. So yeah, he should have definitely come for the previous turn. Now he does the handoff to the line or okay. I'm going for the surf and the blitzer. Do you reckon just desperation, do something? Still uphill anyway. Yeah, didn't do anything wrong, did he? Dog to the dog. That's, like, that's the thing, you know, like, it's not it's not a criticism of him to say it's a comedy mega, but it was still a comedy mega, wasn't it? Yeah, no, he played fine. Yep. There was like maybe one mistake in the first half where he allowed them to, to uh, sack on, but like other than that, you just you played fine. Yep. So there you go. Congratulations, Kill Bill, Blood Yoga without an auger of any variety, and commiserations, Gadenik with his incredible his incredible vampire team that just rolled a bucket full of ones. And uh, thank you very much, Dimmy and Skrull. Absolutely glorious. Thank no you. Didn't even notice there wasn't an ogre. <laughs> there you go and thanks for watching don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic